hey guys welcome back to my channel as you can see today's video is going to be a hair video my hair is wet i just got out of the shower and it's because i've been seeing on tiktok that everybody's using this revlon what is it revlon one step volume volumizer power i i don't oh this revlon salon one step hair dryer and volumizer and i saw this one girl on tiktok i'm so sorry for the background noise there's so much wind today and you can literally hear everything through my window so i'm really sorry there's just so much going on right now because it's the morning but yes i saw this girl on tiktok i wasn't gonna try this because i thought it wasn't good for curly hair because you know these brush blow dryers do not work for curly hair but i saw this girl on tiktok that said if you have curly hair buy it i will put it up right now but she said if you have curly hair to buy it because it works so i was like okay i went on amazon got it for i think 40 dollars and we are going to try it together right now. Okay, so I've opened it already, but I have not turned it on. Oops. I have not turned it on. I haven't. Oh, wait. So there's some. Yeah, I haven't turned it on. I haven't done anything. But I got the blue one. Isn't it so cute? They have a pink one too. And I think other colors, but I wanted the blue. Because I always get everything in pink. And these are the instructions. And if you guys see a mess in the background, I'm sorry. My room is a mess. Okay, so here we have it. It is pretty heavy. Um, so, but what blow dryer is not heavy? You know what I'm saying? Like, this is not as heavy as an actual blow dryer, so that's good. But, yeah, it just comes with this. I'm going to plug it in. Was this the line I was using or not? I have no idea, but we're just gonna go with it. Okay guys, so I plugged it in and I'm sorry if the light changed. My ring light got unplugged and I don't know which light setting I was using. And also don't mind my nails. They look like, they look so bad because I just took off some gel polish and I'm gonna try on to put these fake nails on. So let's see how that goes. Okay, so I see here it has the, the off, the cool, the low, and the high. I just, oh. Okay, she's loud. She is loud. Okay, so I'm just guessing. I'm just going to. Uh, I don't, the girl in the video didn't use it on her wet hair, but isn't the point of a blow dryer to dry your hair? So I'm just gonna. It's it's not super wet like out of the shower, but the bottoms you know are still pretty wet. So I'm just gonna divide my hair. Let's see, let's just start off. The bottom of my hair is the wettest. So, let's see, let's just clip, let's clip it. And I'm guessing you should brush through, even though it's a brush, but you should brush through your hair. And guys, the reason I'm so interested in this product is because I cannot use a blow dryer for the life of me. It just doesn't work out. And I am tired of having to wait for my hair to dry so that I can pass the freaking flat iron. Even though I'm going to pass the flat iron after this probably. But I'm tired. I'm tired. It takes 
so long so let's see how efficient this is i hope it doesn't burn my roots but let's try this okay i'm gonna put it on high because it's just we cannot do low we cannot do low for curly hair okay so let's put it on high and let's do this this chunk right here okay time for the magic Okay, you guys, so this smells like fire. I'm a little scared. I'm a little scared, not gonna lie. But this was one pass. It's dry. The bottoms are not dry, dry yet, but it, it dried it. Okay, let's do a second one. Okay, you guys, so this is how my hair looks with just two coat, two passes. Um, it's at this point, it's completely dry but it's not straight yet. I'm just gonna keep doing it and I'm gonna let you guys know how many passes it takes for my wet curly hair. Okay guys, I have to say I'm impressed. I am impressed. Okay, this isn't the best, the straightest, the flattest, but I am impressed and it leaves it soft like every time I have to do it with the with the straightening with the straight with the flat iron my hair comes out feeling crispy and it just feels like there's chunks of hair everywhere but man it's soft I mean I'm still gonna pass the flat iron at the end to just give it that crisp look you know of hair but she wasn't lying you guys this is pretty good pretty good I, I I forgot to count how many times I passed it isn't that a bummer but I passed it a couple of times you know it, with the time lapse you guys can I'll probably count it with the time lapse but I'm surprised and I'm happy. I am happy. Let's just finish this section, okay? <sighs> okay, you guys, I've finished this first section. Again, I'm impressed. I am impressed. Oh. I was I was coming into this with disappointment. But Revlon, you proved me wrong. You proved me wrong. This is how it looks again, not spectacular, not the you coming out of the salon straight hair, you know, but listen. For a brush a blow dryer, if you want to blow dry your, if you want your hair to be dry quick because you want to pass the flat iron and you don't want to wait for your hair to dry, or you just want to, you just want your hair to be dry and straight, you don't want it curly, you don't want to have it curly, literally get this, like, I'm not joking, I'm not playing you guys, I'm, I'm surprised like I've tried so many brush things in the past life and not in my past life the when I was younger and listen this this is where it's at this is where it's at you guys can see like it's just let me try to show you guys the back Like, yeah, it's probably frizzy. I mean, it is, I feel it. But, you guys, you guys, for something quick, you just wanna pass it through, this is where it's at. Let's just finish the, 
Let's finish the whole head of hair and I will give you my final verdict. Again, I am in disbelief. I just had to tune in here because look at this, look at this, look at this. This is after I took out the other chunk. Guys, and I just realized if you keep passing it after you finished your chunk and you keep passing it on the root, it will start going down. It won't look as frizzy. So just after you finish doing that part, just keep on the root area and then do it all together with that other chunk that you tied up. And look, it doesn't look as frizzy as it would if you didn't pass it over. And also it's not too hot, so you can put it directly on your scalp. You know, I did burn my hand a little bit because I had I had my hand here when it needs to be here. But it doesn't matter. You have to pay a price, you know? Um, but I'm just, I am so happy. I am so happy. I was gonna go, I was, I was, I was looking at that TikTok and I was like, she's a freaking liar. She's a freaking liar. And I was just gonna skip it over. I was like, let me not waste my money so that I can get a piece of caca. And thank you, I wasted my money because this is not a piece of caca. This is my Lord and Savior. But I just saw, oh, and also when you're passing it, pass it under and over so that you can, so that the top doesn't look frizzy, you know? But yeah. Oh, and did I say it has a ringing noise? So that might be a, a little annoying. But if you play music while you're doing your hair, it's gonna be fine because you can't even hear it. But let's just let's just finish the hair, okay? Let's finish it. Okay, you guys, I am done. What do you guys think? I am so I am blown away. I am taken aback. I am surprised. I am in disbelief. This is how it looks all to the front. Obviously not the sleekest, not the best. Also my hair is super damaged. You can tell it's not shiny at all. But I haven't applied any oil or anything. So this is what it looks like these are what the ends look like the ends actually look pretty good like i'm not mad at it at all i think it looks super nice i wouldn't go out like this i would have to pass my straightener but man that did a better job than anything i've ever tried before that's not a blow dryer because obviously a blow dryer could do the job but it's too heavy it is too it's just hard to get to the back like with the brush and here you just have the brush the blow dryer all in one it's honestly my hand wasn't cramping up until the end like right now i feel it but i was fine the whole time it doesn't get too hot like it doesn't guys i'm not sure if that's dandruff flying around the screen and if it is i'm sorry I thought I took it all out, but it's just, I don't know, like, I love it. It was only $40. I know something else has this. It's like the Dyson and that's like $500. I'm, I'm $500. I cannot afford that, but I'm not sure how that does. I'm not sure if it is better, but listen, for $40, this is pretty good so this is my final verdict i give it i'm not gonna give it a 10 out of 10 because it didn't leave my hair looking flawless and i wouldn't go out like this i would have to pass a little bit of the flat iron but i you know i'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 or an 8.5 out of 10. i would say 8.5 out of 10. or should i give it a 9. I don't know. I'm going to go with an 8.5 out of 10 because I kind of look like a little witch right now. But it did the job. I will be using it. It makes everything easier. I don't have to wait for my hair to dry. That's the main thing is that I have to wait for my hair to dry to pass the straightener. And that takes too much time. 
this I just did a straight with my hair wet and it came out it came out like this you know like it's not that frizzy it is a little frizzy but it's not as frizzy as I thought it would be let me just give you my my notes and things that I did while I was using it so obviously part your hair do not do huge chunks because it's just not gonna come out the way you want it to just part your hair um i didn't put anything in my hair before doing this i didn't even put heat protector you should probably do that it'll probably come out better than this i'm an idiot i just wanted to do like a raw review you know um let's see oh i would say pass it down and on the top and for the ends, if you want a little curl, go like this before you finish. Um, again, it makes an, a little noise, but if you play music in the background, it's all good. It is loud as well, but it has so many settings. So, I mean, it sounds like a blow dryer. Like, it's, not, it's a blow dryer. It sounds like a blow dryer. What do you expect? Um, you oh, also... I tried it with brushing my hair before passing it and not brushing my hair and you can do it without brushing your hair because it is a brush so it'll brush your hair for you but if you want an easier pass through you should brush your hair before it but you don't need to that's basically it 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 oh your ear uh, you guys know blow dryers always catch your ear right there you'll be burning and this burns your ear a little bit so be careful with that but if you keep it a, a far away like if you pass it like right up here you might just feel a little heat but that's expected but overall that's all i have to say i'm just i'm very i'm very surprised and i'm very happy very happy but yeah that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it i was trying to just check this out for my curly haired girls and it does work it does work i'm not sure how it'll work if you let your hair dry if you like that better it'll probably work better i don't know but yeah i hope you guys got some use out of this maybe you'll go try it yourself i don't know but if you do try it, let me know and let me know how you feel about it. I give it a, what is it, 8.5 on a 10? Yeah, an 8.5 out of a 10. Okay, that's a lot. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.